Hey guys, I'm off on a solo trip. I'm gonna go help my buddy Ryan uh, install his Wabasto heater. It was easy for my friend Ryan to pull me away for the weekend. He lives in the beautiful Blue Ridge Mountains of Western North Carolina. He also has a great YouTube channel with a cool mix of content. You can find numerous van build videos with even more comedic value than mine. It's like a disco in here. <laughs> As well, he has an awesome road trip series across the beautiful US. Got in late last night and uh, I'm here with Ryan. We are getting ready to install his heater. Indeed we are. <laughs> Indeed so we are. Make sure you check out his channel. I will have a link up in the top corner there and let's do this. Here we go. <laughs> Well, as you guys know, I did not put my heater under the seat, but Ryan definitely wanted it to be under his seat. So <laughs> one of the things that we're dealing with is this bar here uh, to be able to get up and around. So we're looking at putting the heater at an angle so that we have the recommended spacing on each side. We're not sure if that's the way we want to do it. Ryan's doing some Google searching, uh, try, <laughs> trying to figure out uh, the best route. One of the other problems, I guess, to mention is there are wires underneath the seat, uh, underneath the foam, and we are having a real difficult time trying to push them out of the way. They run in a channel of foam on the side and from the, the corner of the seat too, so it's given us some difficulty, but we're gonna make this happen. I will have heat in this van. <laughs> idea where the rest of it went <laughs> there's a hole in my van now there's no going back now <laughs> oh man let me go to the bathroom <laughs> <laughs> i was I, I was thinking a, a little bit ago that um like you know i'm i'm sure your parents were exactly like my parents growing up they, they told us not to talk to strangers and don't meet people from the internet so i just find that uh fun that uh welcome to both my homes internet stranger <laughs> the life of youtubers <laughs> so ryan what are you doing under there man you know i'm just playing uh, i'm trying to hook up this fuel pump there's a bracket on the fuel tank of the van so i'm trying to hook it to this bracket and uh, i've dropped i've now dropped things i got it. and I got there's it. a muffler resting on me oh and my hat fell off <laughs> One of the most uncomfortable positions I've ever been in in my life. The things we do for heat, you know? We got everything done. We changed up where the fuel filter and pump were a million times. Oh yeah, something about that. <laughs> and uh, now we are on putting the heater together. We drilled the four inch hole like I did on my van so that we can just place everything into those holes and uh, bolt it all down. So we are gonna go ahead and do that now and hopefully have a heater before the day's out. <sighs> Fingers crossed, man. Heater's in place. Ryan's gonna go underneath and Screw on those nuts and... Yep, with hands that aren't working. <laughs> we're doing this when it's 10 degrees outside. Good morning. It's a brisk 35 degrees. And we are getting back to the heater install because we didn't finish last night. <sighs> Thought we would, but you know, one too many hiccups in the project, as it always goes in van builds. You ready for this? It's cold. <laughs> Why is it so cold? Why is it winter? We're absolutely tired of getting under the van and not having space, so 
we finally are putting it up on uh it's colder today oh yeah it's freezing. progressively gotten colder throughout this entire project which i feel is kind of fitting it's almost serendipitous <laughs> we're freezing while putting in a heater the coldest temperature will be when the heater turns on exactly <laughs> connecting the fuel line and plugging in our electric you know matt yeah you're right <laughs> Should have got the stands yesterday. We're cold today. It is freezing outside. There's like a wind chill, probably in the 20s. It's gotta be in the 20s. My hands are gone. That I yeah. can't even feel them. It's ridiculous. Uh, but we're on to the final, final part of the project. We are routing the cables through his couch to get back to the battery bank, which he has in the back of his van in the garage. And uh, almost done. We'll be able to fire that heater up before we know it. So we got the van all back together and we're just going to have to fire up and see that the heater works soon. <laughs> One of the next upgrades for our channel that I'm hoping to get is a drone. Uh, baby's awesome. <laughs> so he's gonna make this thing take off and get some B-roll of the vans and uh, kind of show me all what's up with it because that's the exact drone that I want. It's the Mavic Mini. It's like a little bee. Yeah. I just gotta wait till it finds the GPS. Today is the day we are getting the heater running and <laughs> All this wonderful snow. How poetic, right? <laughs> I went in and uh, I grabbed the little heater grate for using on Ryan's van. So we're gonna get up there and fire it up. Your fuel pump will kick in, hit fuel to the heater, and then uh, hopefully combust. <laughs> Fingers crossed. Yeah. <laughs> the first time it can give a fault. Um, so people should expect that. But okay. So if this thing starts flashing. Yeah. Okay. Yep. I think it's like a one, one flash, five flashes, one flash, five flashes. There you go. That's the combustion. You can barely hear the fuel pump. The little rubber hanger that came in your kit is phenomenal. It's way quieter than yours. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, we got heat, baby! Yes! Yes. <laughs> oh, such a relief. Well, we did it. Ryan is finishing putting the gas uh, cap back into the little compartment down there uh, where the ProMaster has the fuel tap. And uh, the heater is roaring. It is pumping in warm air. It is actually warm in the van already. And it's, it's nice and warm on my belly. <laughs> it's good too because it's snowing outside. <laughs> So we're gonna give it uh, probably a half hour to run, maybe a little bit more, and uh, see where we get from here. We decided we are filming some van tours for you. So finishing up this trip uh, to the mountains. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, that was rude. <laughs> Weekend has come to an end. We got the heater installed. We drank lots of beer. We van had, tours. <laughs> <laughs> had some van tours that we did. Just had a great time. So uh, I'm gonna hit the road. I got about a three and a half hour drive back to Winston Salem. Glad I got to see the mountains, your home. And uh, if you guys like this video, go ahead and hit that thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already, and hit that bell to be notified as we post new content. We will see you guys on the next one. Indeed. Bye.